How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Retson. Thanks for watching. I'm in the studio today teaching you guys how to upgrade your 350 to a 455 balanced regulator on your Kirby Morgan band mask. We're going to start by removing the bend tube assembly. We're going to start at the side block end. Once the nut's completely unthreaded, we can go ahead and slide it down the tube. Next, we're going to grab our two wrenches and loosen the other side of the vent tube assembly. Once that's done, go ahead and unthread the large nut and then remove the vent tube assembly. Next, we're going to go ahead and remove the nose block. First, we're going to hold the nose block knob with a cloth and a pair of pliers while unscrewing it from the inside. Next, we're gonna go ahead and remove the nose block knob followed by the packing nut. With the packing nut removed, go ahead and remove the two O-rings at the end of the shaft. Once those are removed, go ahead and pull the shaft out. Next, we're gonna flip the band mask over and start with the oral nasal mask. We're gonna start by removing the microphone. We'll get that out of the way. And after that, you should be able to remove the mask very easily. After that's done, we're gonna go ahead and flip the band mask over again and then remove the screw securing the whiskers to the face port. Before removing the screws, make sure to keep the whisker spacers in a safe spot. We'll need those for later. One more time, we're going to go ahead and flip the band mask over and remove the regulator mount nut and supporting o-ring. Now we should be able to remove the regulator from the band mask with ease. Next, grab our 455 regulator and make sure to align the mounting tube into the mounting hole on the band mask. And install the supporting O-ring as well as the regulator mount nut. Next, we're going to go ahead and install our vent tube assembly into the regulator as well as the side block. Using a torque wrench, go ahead and torque the bent tube assembly mount nut onto the side block. Once that's done, we're going to torque the larger mount nut on the bent tube assembly to lock it in place. Now we're going to use two wrenches, a normal wrench and a torque wrench. The torque wrench is going to go on the jam nut with the regular one on the large mount nut on the bent tube. Next, we're going to flip the mask over and torque the regulator mount nut. Next, we're gonna flip the mask over and install the whiskers using the screws that we had from the 350. After the screws are torqued, Go ahead and flip the mask over, install the oral nasal mask, and then the microphone. All right, once both the oral nasal mask and the microphone are installed, let's go ahead and install the nose block device. First, start with the nose block, slide it right through. Next, we're going to lightly lubricate these two O-rings. Once they're lubricated, go ahead and install them on the nose block, followed by the packing nut. After installing the packing nut, we're going to install the nose block knob, followed by tightening it with a cloth and a pair of pliers. And just like that, you've got a 455 balanced regulator installed on your Kirby Morgan band mask. 